And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And coming up for you very shortly, live action from League One. It's Sheffield Wednesday, and they face Sunderland. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Number 18, Marvin Johnson. Number 14. Here's the Sheffield Wednesday starting 11. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. And the starting 11 for Sunderland. Well, they're also set up with a back five. But I think key today will be the central midfield. Whichever side dominates that area will be able to get their wing backs further forward and get them in the play. And now they get the ball rolling. Takes the shot. Superb stop. Can someone get on the end of this? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Now keeper getting both gloves on the ball. Well, they've played some marvellous football in front of their own fans this term, and the record speaks for itself, Stuart. Well, what a tough team they are to face here. They play such expansive football in possession and work so hard to win it back. I just can't see that changing today. It's a perfect challenge. Byers. On to Patterson. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Great block. Bailey Wright couldn't hang on to it the tackle completely mistimed and you would expect a booking under the circumstances well the card is out and it's yellow yeah it's clumsy and it's late definitely a yellow card surprised to see him go for goal but a routine save in the end oh a perfectly timed pass well hit with power and almost the right precision
Corey Evans, Lyndon Gooch. Evans, they're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Can he take advantage? Oh, denied by the post. Well, the goalkeeper knows it could have been much worse for him. Well, he can't believe his luck there, can he? How is that not a goal? Well, they won't come closer than that. But they are creating chances, and surely a goal is coming. Barry Bannon. And that puts him in position. And he clears it out of harm's way. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Callum Patterson. Gregory on the ball. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Corey Evans. Stewart has it. Luke O'Neill. Surely! A oh, strong hand on the ball. A chance now with the corner. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. And that is not going to help the cause. The header well off the mark. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Bannon. Hunt. And with that, the first half draws to a close. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Bannon. Byers. On the ball, Luongo. Callum Patterson. Went in strongly to win the ball. A really sumptuous ball. Well, beating his opponent and whipped into the box. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Is now a substitution. Number four, Corey Evans, coming onto the pitch. Number 21, Alex Pritchard. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Just the clearance that was needed. Decent position, and the keeper got there. Substitution. 
And they will make the change now. Played over. And the assistant referee has raised his flag offside. George Byers. Barry Bannon with it. Space on the flank. Well, possibilities inside the box. He cuts it back. Well, able to close down the shot. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. showing fine vision could be dangerous and he did well to cut it out Bannon George Byers and offside well close one They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Luke O'Neill. And he's taken it away. Camberi Windas it's a good looking ball in behind and there it is the deadlock has been broken we wondered if a goal would arrive well now it has and will there be a response now Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Luke O'Neill. Stewart has it. Oh, good looking run. But was able to do his job defensively in the end. Bannon. Could be threatening. And the cross goes in. Jack Clark. On the ball, Pritchard. And we've entered the final five minutes. Stewart. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Well, they've decided to make a change.
who's going to get on the end of it and he's clear as lines Barry Bannon well great read there to intercept well on the attack hunting for a late equaliser here clear foul play and as a result a free kick forthcoming Delivered into the box. Not all that convincing defensively. It's still alive. And, and there it is, the final whistle. Well, we ought not to be shocked by this result, considering the fine home record here. Well, by recent standards, they weren't quite at their best today, but they won't care about that. It's three points, a good win, and they continue to make these fans happy.